Now, President Huru Kenyatta has nominated Margaret Nyakango for the position of controller of budget. Currently, she works at the Kenya National Bureau of Statistics, and following the nomination, she will set, she'll face the Finance Committee of the National Assembly for vetting before she is either approved or not to take up the office. She's among the 15 candidates who had applied to replace Agnes Oziambo, whose term came to an end in August. Vivo Energy Kenya has appointed Peter Murungi to replace Joe Buganda as managing director who has quit nearly two years after he was appointed. Murungi has previously served the company as depot manager in Nairobi and Mombasa. He also served as the company's supply and distribution manager as well as marketing manager in Namibia. He set to commence duty on the 1st of December this year. Equity Group Holdings has entered a, a share purchase agreement with George Arthur Forrest to purchase 66.5% of the shares he holds in Bank Commercial Du Congo. Now, Equity pay 10 point, will pay rather 10.7 billion shillings for the 625,354 shares to be acquired in BCDC in a deal to be declared in January next year. Once the transaction is completed, the BCDC business will be amalgamated with that of Equity's existing banking subsidiary in DRC at its Equity Bank Congo. Congo. This merger is set to create the second largest bank in the Democratic Republic of Congo. The bank will also acquire an additional 7.6% from KFW, a German government-owned development bank, pushing its shareholding to 93.6%.